Within the Olive Dynamic Newsstand, there's a number of different ways to navigate through the pages. Probably the easiest and most apparent is the arrow buttons that appear on the left and right hand sides of the publication. Simply clicking on these arrows will navigate you through the pages in a linear fashion. When you're on the cover page, the left hand arrow disappears, or if you're on the last page, the right hand arrow will disappear because you can go no further in the publication. Another alternative is to use the thumbnails, located in the tab at the bottom of the All of Dynamic Newsstand. In this case, it's labeled TOC for Table of Contents, but it may have a different label depending on your publication. Within the thumbnails view, you can scroll all the way through the publication, browsing visually, choose the, public, or the page that you want to navigate to, and simply click on the thumbnail. The application will take you to that particular page and will close the thumbnails view. A third alternative is to leverage the breadcrumbs functionality that's in the lower left hand corner. The furthest left breadcrumb provides you a list of every section within the publication. And if you click on any section in that list, it will take you to the first page of the section. If you go to the right, it shows you every article within that section. So in this case, there are only two articles within the odds and ends section. But if I go to the news section and I mouse over the article titles, you'll see that there's three additional articles there. And clicking on any of them will navigate me to that page. I hope this is a handy tip for using the Olive Dynamic Newsstand, and I hope you enjoy your experience.